Welcome! Today we will talk about ordering fractions and mixed numbers. Number lines can be used to order fractions. I draw a line measuring 1 inch. The first fraction has a denominator of 8. I mark each eighth of an inch on the ruler. The numerator is 2. I find the second eighth marked and label it 2 eighths. On the top of the number line, I label each fourth of an inch because the denominator of the second fraction is 4. The numerator is 3. I label the third fourths. Now, I use a different color to represent halves on the number line. The numerator of the third fraction is 1. I label 1 half on the ruler. Now I will put the fractions in order from least to greatest. The smallest fraction is 2 eighths, followed by 1 half, and ending with 3 fourths. Let's order these fractions again, but this time we will find a common denominator. A common denominator is a number that is a multiple of all of the denominators. 8 is a multiple of each of the numbers, and is a common denominator we can use to make equivalent fractions. On to the second fraction. 2 times 4 equals 8. I multiplied 2 by the bottom, so I need to multiply 2 by the top. 2 times 3 equals 6. The equivalent fraction is 6 eighths. Looking at the final fraction, 2 times 4 equals 8. I did it to the bottom, so I need to do it to the top. 1 times 4 equals 4. Now we have the equivalent fraction of 4 eighths. Then we compare the numerators of the equivalent fractions. Finally, we put the fractions in order from least to greatest. It looks like this, 2 eighths, 1 half, 3 fourths. This last example involves a mixed number. I will put the numbers in order from least to greatest. When ordering and comparing mixed numbers, you start by comparing the whole. There is only one mixed number. This is the largest fraction because it has one whole and two eighths of a whole all together. We can use benchmark fractions to compare the last two fractions. One half is exactly half of the whole. Three is more than half of four so this fraction is larger than one half. This example ordered from least to greatest is one half, three fourths, and one and two eighths. There are many ways to order fractions and mixed numbers. Pick the way that helps you the most. Enjoy your practice.